Hey movement athletes, have you ever found yourself struggling to breathe in core exercises? Well this is most people, so I figured it would be a good idea to break this down what I like to teach people so they understand how to engage the core as well as breathe properly. So we'll first start off, uh, Rebecca is going to lay flat on her back. And the first thing I actually have people do is put their hands on the stomach and just to feel that we're breathing through the diaphragm and, and three-dimensionally. So if Rebecca is relaxed, and, and the first thing is, can you breathe three-dimensionally through the stomach, upwards, laterally, through the back, everything expanding in these dimensions. Okay, next thing, flatten the lower back. So now we're engaging the core. And if I were to slide my hand, I should not be able to reach through the tunnel of the lower back. So same thing, the back is, is uh, contacting the floor. Same three-dimensional breathing. Next, we'll go into the tabletop or the dead bug position. So. 90 degrees with the uh, knees and hips, and then vertical with the arms. So same idea, back is contacting the floor. Can you still breathe three dimensionally? And it gets a little bit harder each time, of course, so maybe this is where you're at with it. And then we can keep making the dead bug more difficult. So extending uh, just arms or just legs or both arms, opposite, same sides. So Rebecca can try a few different things. And whenever she moves a limb, we're gonna pause there and fully breathe. Uh, we'll do a full inhale and a full exhalation before coming back. So these are definitely more advanced versions of extending the legs. That starts to get more difficult. Okay, so now we're starting to get into the hollow hold. And then can you still breathe in this position? Okay, definitely gets more difficult. And if you find yourself holding your breath and maybe your back's coming off the floor, well, you've reached your max and you can regress it and go back to a uh, scaled down version and making sure you're focusing on the whole point of this was how do you breathe and engage your core at the same time. So how did it go?